like I was saying, you guys. So I didn't want to bother anybody about the, the Garland and just getting it. So I was like, okay, no big deal. Whatever, I'll just try and find something else. Thanks to my grandma, when after going to the mall, we came back home. Um, she looked online and she was like, oh, we're going to get this edible cake topper for you. And the cupcake toppers. We're looking, we're looking, we're looking. I see that same Garland on Amazon at the same price. $12 and I don't know what it was. But, yeah, um, it was there. I said, it's probably sold out. No. If it shows it on my grandma's account that it's there, why won't it show it on my account? That. It's like, why did you say it, that you're sold out when you're not? But anyways, no big deal, right? Okay, so the next thing that I need to pick up is plates. Same thing as the straws, blue and, white, blue and yellow. Blue and yellow. Because I'm thinking Riverdale Bulldogs, blue and yellow. Their jerseys, blue and yellow. Not bad, or yellow and blue, however you guys want to say it. Um... Yeah, so plates, just plates, silverware, cups, probably cups. I think I'm going to get red cups, so we'll, we'll see. Then food. Now, food, I know we're going to be getting last minute. So, I don't have to worry about that. Then I put more candy, and more candy like, as I explained before, white gumballs, sports chocolate, and bracelet candies. Last thing is air pump, because, as we all know, nobody wants to blow this up by mouth. So why not just get an air pump and go, what, bum, 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 and let the air go in and stay in, and that's it. Uh, I hope that works, but it doesn't. So anyways, that is everything that I put on my list. That I really have to get last week. <laughs> that I really have to go and get pretty soon. And I hope it's worth it. I just hope. Because if not, I'm going to be bawling. Not even bawling, just... I don't even know how to explain it. But, yeah. Um, I got to work on this again. Hopefully, try not to... <laughs> Me trying to see if it'll go on yet, but it will. You don't see it because my light is on, but yeah. It's transparent, so it'll, yeah, it'll go into the plastic. Anything, another thing, like I was saying, so I named all the candy, right? So we have Jughead's Burgers, Veronica's Pearls, the Blossoms, which is the cherries. Uh, Jingle Jangle, which is the Pixie Stick, uh, Fizzle Rocks, which are the Pop Rocks, uh, Team Bulldogs for the sports chocolate candy, I want to say, and Betty's Scrunchy, because why not? That's how I'm labeling the easels. And again, if I show you guys, it's these, which again, I got these at Target for $3.00 be exact and boy was I surprised to find these for three dollars because normally a set of these would be five dollars but hey why not right anything anything works and I'm so glad um I will be doing a setup video so you guys will see that soon am I happy about this not really because this is by connect the dots or connect the numbers. But this turned out pretty great. Uh, it turned out pretty great. Even though it doesn't come with instructions, it is hard. Again, because it looks like this. And this is what you see on the inside. It's basically nothing. And what I was thinking of doing is taking like cardstock and gluing the bottom of it. So in case somebody actually... Puts in a quarter or something, it officially becomes mine. Not really. <laughs> Not really. Just saying. It's just to 
it was just a joke. So this is just decoration. Um, so yeah, it looks like this at the bottom. Literally just, yeah. So this is what it looks like on the side. This is what it looks like on the front. Now when I got this, I'm like, oh, it's probably going to have like some mechanical thing that you can like actually press the buttons and then like this will it'll play songs like whatever song you want but no so yeah that is that and it looks pretty cool now i've already tested some of the songs like some of this i you guys can take a screenshot of it if you want or however you want to do and see if these songs are actually real um, I've already tested them using my Alexa off, which is funny because she says that none of, about half of the songs don't even, um, exist. Now, I don't want to get copyrighted because everybody knows one of these songs, um, Party Around the Clock exists. When I asked for Party Around the Clock using, you know what, she played the song from Greece, And I was laughing. I couldn't help but laugh. I was just laughing my bones off like, oh, how fun. Again. Straws. I'm not going to take this thingy off, because it says, bo all it does is just box papers, the little, um, rubber band. I'm going to let whoever's making my cupcakes deal with this, so that way, that way they don't have to, like, yeah, I don't have to worry about losing all of them. So I'm just going to keep the rubber band on, on them, so I, again, so I don't lose the straws and this is what they look like so this is the blue one and then these are the yellows now they are different so like again you have the thinner ones and then you have the big bigger ones on the inside which it would have been better if they did like thin then then uh big but i get it i get the point I get what they're going for there. Do I? I don't even know why I'm taking, putting all of these in here because I got to take them all out and reinflate this thing. Why don't I just do that right now so you guys can be my witnesses and have proof that I did do what I was supposed to do? I'm just gonna go ahead and then, well. It's almost gone, so why not? I'm just gonna <laughs> just lick it off. <laughs> Cause all that's left on there, all that's all that would be left on there is just the lip liner that I have on underneath it, which is this one from Wet and Wild, and it's cruelty free, and it's six five six eight red the scene. Red this scene and it's a gel lip liner and this is how it looks that was a trick i mean because i've only been using red lipstick by itself i i didn't know if you put on the lip liner it would make it look glossier and your lips would look a little cooler so that's something new that i've learned about makeup and it's not like I'm trying to become a makeup guru. But yet again, I do have a channel, a makeup channel, and it is called Maria's Makeup, I want to say, or Makeup Tips. However you say it, I will be posting on there pretty soon when I edit the video that I have to make, which will be fun. Anyway, so I'm going to take all of this out and then reinflate this again. Because firstly, I have to inspect it and see if there's like any holes in it because if there are holes which I've read on all the comments um yeah yeah it would be 
Would it be my, would it be my best decision to buy? Would it be a good decision to buy something like this again? No. Would I recommend to buy it? No. Not unless you want to deal with holes. If you want to deal with holes, have a have a fantastic time using it, cause I don't want to do it ever. But yeah, I have to see. Oh, I hear it. Yeah, I should probably deflate it and let it rest. Because it's been holding all the party stuff. But I don't know. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. So I'm going to go ahead and take this. All that stuff out and just lay it on my bed. Because another thing I had got was this six tier hanging shelf or whatever. To put the things in there in case I didn't want that. Or in case something happens to this. And I was like, what's the point of using that? What? I could just put everything in here. Well, this is why. I didn't even think of it. Again, I literally didn't even think I was going to have to reinflate this whole thing. Now again, you guys don't know what this is. I put the glass jar on the bed. So this is how it looks like. It's smaller than me, but yeah. Um, you have one here. There's a total of six of these, I think. So you have one here. And I know it's like one on the side. Yeah, one here. So one, two on each side. Right? Then you have one here. Uh oh. It like moved my camera. Okay, so you have two on the sides. Two of those things on the sides. Then you have one here at the top. Um, one here. Like literally in the corner. There's here. You see the little plastic thingy here? Yeah, one there. And then you have one here. Which is something I can't believe because in total there should be six. So one, two, three, four, five. If I'm right. Again, if I'm right. So, yeah. These are good. These sides, they're good. Okay, well, I could be losing it, but yeah. There's that. I'm going to take this out, and I always do that because it gets stuck. And as you can see, like, there's full plastic at the bottom. So I take this, and go like that, and Boy, it is hard. Now I quickly cover it with my thumb, and then when I am ready to put the lid on it, I let it go. So in three, two, one, but I'm trying to make sure that the air doesn't come out. And then I go like that. Please ignore whatever just happened a second ago. And I push in. Just push it down. And then push it. 
Now guys, if you have a better hack to save this, literally, if you have a better hack to like keep this with air, let me know in the comments down below. Cause boy does this get on my nerve having to blow it up. But again, I gotta do what I gotta do. So should probably put my hair up, but it's okay. Now we do the same thing but on the other side. Go ahead and put my hair up because I cannot stand this. I was going to put my hair. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave it there. Hopefully, it doesn't fall. Anyway, so this is what's happening. I'm putting a new, new error in it. To keep it inflated. Um, again, if you have a better hack to keep the air inside of it, let me know. It would be a darn good help. Literally. No, like literally, it would be helpful. So we're gonna do the same thing on this side. Hopefully the air doesn't come out again, but we'll see. So there's air in that. Now I am going to have to redo this, these sides. So just opening it up and blowing it. Making sure it has air. Now it has not a lot of air, but it has a little bit of air. So it makes it stronger. Do the same thing to this side. Now, when I grab a hold of it, you can I can pinch it. So that means that there's not a lot of air. Rather than when I grab this side, there's a lot of air. Totally forgot that there was no air in this one. So, grab it and put air. Again, if you can't pinch it, that means that there's enough air in it. So then we close that. And there's enough. There's enough. I'm gonna rather than this side where you can I can literally pinch it. On this side I can't pinch it at all. So we do this and then we do the same. Same thing. Add air to it. Now the reason why you just saw me use my teeth is because I use the teeth to bring up the little thing. So that way it's easier when I just open it up and I just put air in it. Now this side, it didn't necessarily need a lot of air, but the air managed to stay in. And I can like kind of squeeze it, but not so much. So these are again separate. So each side has what is it, one of these things, the plastic things. This side, this whole thing is connected. So it has one of these, if you guys see that. And then, the same thing for this side so these the sides are separate this thing is connected by one these are connected by another one. so it has again 
another thing. Where is it? Right here. Right there. That thing. So that's three. Right? Then these have one on the sides. So it, it's right there. And then right there. So those two inflate the entire bottom part. Those three inflate the entire top part. So that makes sense. Now it looks like if I stand it up on the on the bed, it looks like this. An amazing jukebox. So that's one of the things. Um anyways guys, I think my time